just finished fueling up and stringing up and greasing. George is uh, being a good old boy and giving his a wash, look. Spot's not a fan of the uh, pressure washer. So he's sitting there, he's just, just guarding it, making sure it doesn't hurt anyone. He's a good dog, really. I'm gutted. Obviously, being busy, I've um, been rushing around a bit, doing a bit of woodwork, then off to the farm, working on that. And I've left my chisel laid on a bit of oak, like the green oak overnight. Just obviously nonchalantly, just laid it down while I was working, and then I've, I've left. Look at that one day. It's crazy. So it's got. It's luckily not not like touched the edge. So I'm just gonna get a bit of like fine sandpaper, sort of out. I've waxed it as well. I've put some protective wax on that because I was like, I don't want it. I want it to stay really nice. <laughs> That's the end of that one, isn't it? Wax it up again. Don't have to do that every day. I'd say good as new, but it's not quite. But uh, it's a tool, it's meant to be used. So today's mainly gonna be about finish grooving these tenons through the spindle. I've got 10 more to do and get all the shoulders cut and then uh, see if we're going bailing, if not, carry on uh, cutting them tenons out. Testing the little trolley. I paid, I think about 70 quid for these trolleys. Like a closing down option. There's six of them. I sold the other three for about uh, five quid each. Right, I got my money back on the other three, and they're dead handy. What's great about it is having like, a few of them rather than one bench that you can move around having three or four is like you can have different projects on the go and move stuff around the workshop because they're smaller I wouldn't particularly want to work off them they're a bit uh, a bit rattly on the nylon casters but perfect for lobbing timber on Look at all the crap that's built up on the blades from that green oak. I'm gonna need a good clean now. That might be it for today, woodworking, uh, off out bailing. Got that for a door to repair in there. That oak one. Made these gates as well, don't you? 